What's up guys? It's Mama Deadhead and I am back with another reaction to Clone Wars. So this episode is season three, episode three, and it is called Supply Lines. Now, upon looking online at the chronological order, this seems to be the last one like out of order for a bit. I go back to season one and I watch a good bit, a good bit of that before jumping around again. But I mean, with this many seasons and this many episodes, I, I totally understand why there are some, like, more flashback type episodes. But, yes, season three, episode three. Before I jump into that, I wanted to talk just a little bit about my Patreon. Now, I know that I rarely talk about this on my channel, but I need to talk about it a little bit more, at least just mention it in my videos. I do have a Patreon. I have tiers ranging from $1 to $20 a month. The $1 one, even if you guys just want to go for a $1 one, that would sincerely help me out and I would very much appreciate that. And for $1 a month, you get tons of Athena photos. And if you sign up now, you get all of the previous ones that I've uploaded. And I was looking, you know, just a minute ago when I was updating everything and I have like 400 and something posts on here so you're you can scroll back and see a lot of Athena photos with with just that but I wanted to mention it because this month well until the end of the month May 31st I'm doing a special offer so if you sign up with five dollars a month or above until the 31st of May I am going to be sending out all of those special people a five by seven framed photo taken from one of the many hikes that I have been on lately and if you guys have seen some of the photos well actually you know if you sign up for one dollar a month you're gonna see like a lot of stuff that I've taken hiking and then if you're on my social medias you might see some of the stuff I've taken in my yard just of beautiful flowers and you know all of that you you will get one of those if you have a preference if you see a photo and you're like oh I really love this photo I want this photo I will send you that photo no problem now this ranges <laughs> in what you get. There are, like I said, quite a few different tiers. There's $1 a month, which is Mama Strawberry Patch. There is Hobby Helpers, which is $5 a month, which I changed and that's why there is a special offer out. You guys are going to get exclusive content just for like my hobbies like hiking and gardening and art and all of that type of stuff that you guys don't get to see on my channel. My socials get to see a little bit, but yes. And you get special outtakes and bloopers. You get polls. I, I only have one patron right now and I've had a few since, you know, I've started, but I've never really had enough to do like a proper poll. And I would, I would love to do that. At $10, you get a handwritten thank you from me and Athena and you get a video a month made from ideas that you discuss with me on here. You definitely, this is more of like an intimate look at what like my channel and my life is. It's much more like, you know, up close, you get to see Athena more, you get to see like family time more and just, and just what it's like. But the $20 a month is the King's Corner and I wanted to talk about it just a little bit because I did change one little thing on it. One big thing for all of my reaction fans is you get the full length reaction of whatever it is. I know that I do The Walking Dead mostly. I'm venturing out. You get all the shows that I do. You get a monthly personal video chat with me one on one. Well, one on one. <laughs> Athena's always going to be there. So that, that should, you know, <laughs> that should be known. Um, and then you will receive a spe special package from me and Athena that includes at least one piece of art that I've made. And Athena loves to send art too, so you'll get some Athena art too. And that, that particular one, the package is only a one-time offer. It's not monthly, but that is what you get at King's Corner. And a special thank you to Walter for being in the King's Corner for a year a little over a year. Thank you, Walter. You're amazing. Um, but yes, I just want to talk about that just a little because I, I'm sorry, I never talk about that. I'm, I'm, I haven't ever been one to be like, you know, slap the like button, subscribe, you know, check out my Etsy store, check out my Patreon. 
I've had like links in the description, but it's just not really been my thing. I know that I should say it more. I just don't want to seem like pushy, if that makes sense. I know that so many people are like, I didn't even know you had a Patreon. Why didn't you talk about your Patreon? Um, I, I don't know. Just feel, feel awkward talking about it. But even just the $1 a month, I, every time anyone signs up, I'm just like, oh my god, <laughs> it's like the best thing ever. My current goal, because you can set goals on Patreon, instead of it being a um, money goal like before, I made it a um, like count goal, like per patron. So my current goal right now is just to have 10 patrons at any amount, and when that happens, I'm going to make an exclusive Patreon video that is a tour of my garden and plants and a tour of my office and I know that sounds a little bit weird like oh a tour of an office for like 10 patrons but I have so much stuff in my office and I can tell you guys some amazing stories that like have never been told on my channel before so we get to 10 that is what's going to happen and I'm also going to sign up for the premium version of Grammarly, just because you guys know that I'm a contributor at Unhead Walking, and that would really help me. So, that and then the special video only for Patreon. You guys will not see it on my YouTube channel. Now, all of my content, I've had this for a while, and all of my content on here stays the same. This is just extra if you guys, you know, like really, really want to be involved with what is going on. So, with all of that being said, I'm going to go ahead and start supply lines, and I see Jar Jar Binks in this, so unpopular opinion. I love Jar Jar Binks, so I'm going to get this started, and I'm so excited. Every time I just, like, see the Clone Wars on my screen, I get, like, so happy for some reason. Um, but yes, thank you guys so much for joining me and watching the Clone Wars with how far behind I am. Um, but yeah, let's go ahead and get it started. Okay, quote. Will, there's a way. Okay, pretty simple. <laughs> I swear, having only seen the movies and then this series, it is so weird to see like this inside look at the clones and like rooting for them, knowing what happens. I love these voices. And the animation. I can speak. Oh, I love the I love the animation, sorry. Troops around the food. Fuel. Supply lines, Ammunition. he said it. Go away. Go away. Go away. I mean, this just sounds like Dr. Mix. <laughs> it's about to come in. It's just uh, the music. Speak with the high exalted huh. king of Twitter. He's... Representative Binks. It's Shall a pleasure to see you, Our laws of hospitality demand that we won't take a minute. Organa's the only voice that I've heard that hasn't really sounded like the movie actor voice. Anna, you sound majesty. Let me do the talking, okay? <laughs> Millions will be starving and dying without your help. My esteemed colleague and I humbly beg. Do not make your decision in haste, your man. Go away! Other factors. I don't want to see any bad guys today. Just go away. Just everything George Irving says is funny. Like, it's so terrible. I just, but it changes nothing. <laughs> it changes everything. George Irving, same. The separatists are not here. First off, go away. Oh. Hello? Man, I don't know. Your Majesty. War. The people of Ryloth did not ask to be invaded. Do not yeah. let them suffer because war empathize with the plight of the Twi'lex. I mean, you don't. This is not about saving them when they are fighting. I'm interested to see what he Come says. Hurry, hurry! The babies! I had to show the, the kids, Nothing. man. The is kids. The gun ready? Yes, sir. 
The kids don't have it's a say anymore. You know? No escape. I have made my decision. I already I'm hate sorry, it. Senator Organ. Knew it! For the sake of my people, Quiteria. A wise ruling. Oh, go majesty. away! Ha! Ah. What are Risa gonna do now? My friends. <laughs> Innocent victims caught between the warring factions through no fault of their own. I'm glad you agree, Your Highness. Nice. I'll signal you when the ships are ready to depart. Misa won't let you down, Senator. Representative Binks. <laughs> Binks, you can come to dinner at my house any day. Though it's for long, you'll have to move quickly to get your families out of danger. Ah, I wanna cry. Don't cry, don't cry. Don't cry. Charm is still angry. He feels betrayed. Their voices are funny too. Uh, no clones, just explosives. Explosives. Gotcha. <laughs> no clones, just explosives. <laughs> that would be pretty cool, got to admit. Treaty violation. You are welcome to present it to the full set. It takes years for the Senate to decide anything. <laughs> Drats! <laughs> you play a dangerous game, Morgana. Next time, you will not get away with this. You know. The Republic you can has heart with you. Be considered our new challenge. Tell the Jedi I am open to victory with them. Master Yoda will be glad to hear Yay! For now at least. Oh, that was such a good episode. Oh. Alright guys, so that episode is over. I genuinely enjoyed this just as I have all of the other um, Clone Wars content that I have seen. War is tricky. And war is hard, even if you're all the way one side or you can see that, you know, there is a very clear right and wrong in, you know, whatever side there is, there's always going to be innocent lives taken when a country or a place is invaded. And it tugged at my heartstrings in this one because they're little kiddos, they're babies, and I hate that because, I mean, to an extent, adults can make their own choices. They can still very much be stuck, but kids, like, kids don't get to make a decision. If Even if you say, you know, like, <laughs> we're gonna bomb you at 2 p.m., Oh, we're going to bring down our Jedi force at 2 p.m. 
uh, have everyone out. If a parent stays, that kid doesn't have the option, you know what I mean? So, it's hard. Now, I did not catch this Jedi's name because it was a hard one. But even the clones here in this case, I mean, they sacrificed themselves. You, you can't really, you know, put that any other way. They sacrificed themselves and fought the good fight for their side. And that is so admirable. That's just amazing. I'm gonna get, I'm gonna get teary-eyed. No, I don't want to get teary-eyed. In Clone Wars, not yet. Not yet. Not when I know what's gonna come later. Um, <laughs> sorry. But, oh Man, so much gets packed into one episode. It's, it's literally insane. But, I don't know. This might be my favorite so far. If we're talking episode-wise. Obviously, the movie... It's amazing. That would probably be over anything so far. The theatrical release on the chronological list, that is. But this likely was my favorite one so far. It, um, just, it, re it really showed, you know, uh, good guys doing a good thing and, like, children making it out. You know, getting food and supplies and that's, that's just... The bees knees, that's the best thing. So I guess that's all I can say about this episode so I don't get too emotional about it. Um, but like I said at the beginning of this, if you guys would be so awesome as to check out uh, my Patreon, I would be forever grateful. I realize that I didn't say this earlier. Again, not good at it, um, but there is a link in the description to my Patreon there. There always is. In case, you know, maybe you can't afford it right now. No pressure. Guys, no pressure. It just feels so weird just even talking about this. Um, but if you do want that extra content, you want that sneak peek into into our life, um, that's there for you guys. And then my socials too, of course, because I do post on my socials a bit. Twitter and Instagram. So, all at Mama Deadhead. Just type in at Mama Deadhead and you'll find me. So, yeah. That's going to be all for this reaction. I genuinely appreciate you guys sticking with me and watching Clone Wars. Appreciate you guys. Um, yeah, that's going to be all for this video. Thank you guys so much. And like I always say, think positive thoughts and send positive vibes. Bye, guys. What's up, everybody? Always think positive thoughts and send positive vibes. It's from Mama Deadhead, y'all. And I always remember, I know what's happening. And I know what's going on. And please, always nurture your inner spirit. Peace.